Hi, greetings to all our business associates under our empowered consumers community all over the Philippines, sa lahat ng mga mentors, coaches, leaders all over the world. Good day to each and every one of you. This is your Vice President for Business Development, Surgeon Gonzalez. And uh, bibigyan lang ako ng uh, few messages to each and every one of you sa gitna ng mga nangyayaring ito sa buong Pilipinas at sa buong mundo. Uh, this is unprecedented. We are uh, we never uh, perceived this. Walang naka-anticipate na mangyayari ito pero ganoon pa man, we are ready. Uh, we are prepared as a business. Alam nyo, bago pa man din nangyari itong enhanced uh, community quarantine ay nagkaroon tayo ng uh, crisis planning and business continuity planning with our top management uh, to assure our distributors that business will continue. Of course, may mga restrictions um, here in the Philippines and all over the world. Ayan. So, uh, we should never be anxious and worried because we are in a far better position than ever. Uh, marami lang re restrictions in place because uh, the government uh, is not allowing anyone to go out of their house. Uh, pati tayo, apektado dyan, no? Ang business natin, apektado dyan. But nonetheless, we, there are some things that we can do and uh, meron tayong mga bagay na pwedeng gawin sa kabila ng mga pangyayaring ito, no? And uh, I'd like to just uh, uh, highlight yung importance ng resiliency or being resilient sa mga panahon na to. Ang uh, uh, resiliency as an attitude or attribute is very important because resi resiliency by definition means advancing despite adversity. Meaning, continuing, moving on, tuloy-tuloy uh, lang kahit na sa kabila ng mga may ganitong challenge, problema, or obstacles. Bilang uh, leaders, bilang uh, entrepreneur, isa yan sa dapat katangian na meron ng bawat isa because we face more challenges than many individuals. Pag entrepreneur ka, pag leader ka, expect na mas maraming obstacles, challenges na haharapin ka. So, this is the best time for you, ladies and gentlemen, to enhance your problem-solving skills. Ayan, isa yan sa napaka-importante na dapat meron ka as a leader. So, we can never be passive. We can never be paralyzed because of fear, anxiety, worry. So, dapat kahit pa paano, meron kang ginagawa in terms of running your network, in terms of running your community. Marami tayong pwedeng gawin, no? Uh, Unang-una, katulad ng ginagawa namin, we are maximizing the online platform to convey our message to all our distributors, consumers, leaders, and business associates all over the world. So, pwede nyo rin gawin yan sa grupo nyo na for the meantime na naka-home quarantine tayong lahat, make sure to get in touch with your group, make sure to get in touch with your leaders, consumers, sa community ninyo by using this platform o yung tinatawag natin online. Importante ito because, uh, again, hindi tayo pwede maging passive. Pwede pa rin naman tayong maging active, hindi nga lang physically, hindi nga lang uh, field marketing, but online marketing. So, take this opportunity to communicate with your group. So, kahit nasa bahay, walang reason para magkaroon ka ng excuse na wala kang magawa, hindi ka makapag-communicate, hindi ka makapag-build ng business o mag-grow ng business. In fact, this is the best time para kausapin yung mga prospects ninyo. Kasi ha, para naka-line up na hanggang sa mag-normalize na ulit ang business. Ito rin ang opportunity para mag-follow up, para mag-training ka online sa mga grupo mo, para turuan sila ng mga dapat nilang gawin habang ganito ang climate. So, be resilient in terms of your physical, your mental, your spiritual, and social life. Uh, hindi tayo natatapos sa uh, ganitong uh, sitwasyon lamang na tayo'y nasa bahay at walang magagawa. So, make sure na meron tayong uh, activity kahit papaano. So, again, uh, being resilient at this point in time is very, very important. That's why let's not be paralyzed because of fear, because of anxiety, because of worry. Baka iniisip ng marami. Uh, ito po'y, uh, you know, uh, permanent problem na matatapos po ito kung tayo'y magtutulong-tulong. So, again, um, get in touch with your group. Huwag tayong maparalyze sa mga pangyayaring ito. Kasi uh, kahit na merong challenge, adversity, na hindi tayo makalabas, maraming mga uh, platforms, maraming paraan ang pwede natin gamitin para to get in touch with our group. Kaya huwag kayong mababahala in terms of uh, 
the company. We are doing everything in the next coming weeks. May mga lalabas tayong facilities online para po maservisyuan kayo ng mas maayos pa. And no less than uh, the President, Dr. Ed, ang uh, pinaka-tamang uh, tao para mag-explain sa inyo ng mga developments na ginagawa natin. So, ang message ko, ladies and gentlemen, ito yung panahon na hindi dapat tayo magpadala sa ating takot and we keep moving, we keep moving forward, we keep taking action, let's go get our goals. At uh, again, gamitin natin yung mga technology available on hand para makapagnegosyo pa rin tayo. And other than that, I'll be coming up with uh, more trainings in the future uh, about resiliency. Uh, ito po ay lalabas in the next coming days. This will be in pure English para po lalo pang maintindihan at uh, hindi lang tayo mga distributors, consumers dito sa Philippines but all over the world. So my message, uh, let's all be positive. Let's uh, uh, not be paralyzed by these problems. Let's all be resilient. And when things back to normal, makakaasa kayo. Matibay na matibay pa rin ang ating company. We are in a far, far better position than ever. We have planned for this, although wala namang naka-anticipate nito, walang may gusto nito. But we are here to help you. We are here to make sure that meron tayong business continuity. So, God bless everyone. So, stay alert and gawin natin ang responsibility natin sa buong mundo. Power! Power!